Whether it's from a forgotten pot on the stove or an overcooked dish in the oven, that acrid burnt food smell can linger for hours, if not days. But don't worry, brave chef. This video will guide you on how to get rid of burnt food smell with simple but proven methods. But first, what are the tools and materials you'll need to complete this task? For the full list and where to get them, check the description and pinned comment below. Now that you have all your tools and materials ready, let's get rid of that awful smell. Get rid of it! Remove any burnt food or debris causing the smell. This could be anything from burnt food on a stove to a scorched oven tray. By removing the source of the smell, you'll be able to tackle the issue more effectively. To do this, simply grab a damp cloth or paper towel and wipe away any visible residue or debris. If the burnt food or debris is stubborn and won't come off with just a damp cloth, try using a cleaning product specifically designed for removing burnt on food. When using a cleaning product, it's important to follow the instructions carefully and use protective gloves if necessary. If you're dealing with a burnt smell in an oven, you may need to remove the oven racks and wipe them down separately. You can use the same damp cloth or paper towel for this task, where you may want to use a scrub brush to help remove any stubborn debris. If the burnt food or debris has caused any damage to the surface it was on, such as leaving behind burnt on residue or stains, you may need to use additional cleaning methods or even replace the surface altogether. Ventilate the area. Open all the windows and doors in the affected area to let fresh air in. This will help dilute the burnt smell and circulate fresh air throughout the room. If you don't have enough natural ventilation in the room, use a fan to help increase air circulation. This can be a standing fan, a box fan, or even a portable air purifier with a fan setting. Place the fan near an open window or doorway to help draw in fresh air and push out the stagnant, burnt-smelling air. Simply ventilating the area won't completely eliminate the burnt smell. However, it will help reduce it and make the air in the room more breathable. Boil vinegar and water. Fill a small pot with equal parts water and white vinegar. Use enough to cover the bottom of the pot, but not so much that it overflows when boiling. A good rule of thumb is to use about one cup of each. Next, place the pot on the stovetop and bring the mixture to a boil. Once it starts boiling, reduce the heat to low and let it simmer for a few minutes. This will help release the vinegar vapors into the air, which will help neutralize the burnt smell. After simmering for a few minutes, turn off the heat and let the pot sit on the stovetop for a few hours or overnight. This will give the vinegar plenty of time to work its magic and absorb any lingering burnt smells. Once you're ready to clean up, Dispose of the vinegar and water mixture and wipe down the pot with a damp cloth or sponge. If you're dealing with a particularly stubborn burnt smell, you can repeat this process as many times as needed until the smell is gone. Some people also like to add other ingredients to the mixture, such as lemon slices or cinnamon sticks, to give the air a pleasant scent. Use baking soda. Sprinkle a generous amount of baking soda over the affected area. Use enough to cover the entire surface, but not so much that it becomes a thick layer. After sprinkling the baking soda, let it sit for a few hours or overnight. This will give the baking soda enough time to absorb the burnt smell. If the area is small, you can cover it with a clean towel or sheet to help keep the baking soda in place. Once the baking soda has had time to absorb the smell, use a vacuum cleaner or broom to sweep up the baking soda. Be sure to get all of it, as any remaining baking soda can leave a white residue behind. Use activated charcoal. Place several bowls of activated charcoal in strategic locations around the room. The number of bowls you use will depend on the size of the room and the strength of the smell. Moreover, be sure to place them in areas where they won't be easily knocked over or spilled. Leave the bowls of activated charcoal in place for a few hours or overnight. This will give the charcoal enough time to absorb the burnt smell. After the allotted time has passed, remove the bowls of activated charcoal from the room. Use coffee grounds. Gather some coffee grounds. You can use fresh or used grounds, either will work. 
Next, find a bowl or plate to hold the coffee grounds. Use a shallow bowl or plate with a wide surface area so that the coffee grounds can effectively absorb the smell. Once you have your bowl or plate in coffee grounds, place the coffee grounds in the bowl or spread them out on the plate. Then, place the bowl or plate in the room where the burnt smell is strongest. If the smell is very strong or the room is large, place multiple bowls or plates in different areas of the room. Leave the coffee grounds in the room for a few hours or overnight. During this period, the coffee grounds will absorb the smell. Use citrus fruits. First, gather some lemons, limes, or oranges. Then, cut them into slices that are about a quarter inch thick. Next, fill a pot with water and place it on the stove. Add the citrus slices to the pot. Bring the water to a boil and allow the pot to simmer for a few minutes. The heat will release the citrus oils into the air, which will help freshen the air and neutralize the burnt smell. After a few minutes, turn off the heat and let the pot sit for a few hours or overnight. This will give the citrus time to continue releasing its fragrance and freshening the air. Once the time has passed, remove the pot from the stove and discard the citrus slices. Use a commercial odor eliminator. Commercial odor eliminators are formulated to neutralize odors and are readily available in stores. They come in different forms such as sprays, gels, and candles. Different types of odor eliminators work better for specific types of odors. Be sure to select the one that is designed to eliminate burnt food smell. Follow the instructions provided on the packaging to ensure that you are using the product correctly and safely. Make sure to use the recommended amount of product. If the burnt smell persists, you may need to reapply the product or try a different type of odor eliminator. Use an air purifier. If you're dealing with a stubborn burnt food smell that just won't go away, an air purifier can be a great tool to have on hand. Choose an air purifier that is designed to remove odors and smoke from the air. Look for a model that has a HEPA filter, which can capture tiny particles in the air that may be causing the odor. Next, place the air purifier in the room where the burnt smell is strongest. Let it run for a few hours or overnight, depending on how strong the odor is. As the air purifier runs, it will filter the air in the room and remove any particles that are causing the burnt smell. This can include smoke, cooking fumes, and other odors that may be lingering in the air. After a few hours or overnight, turn off the air purifier and take a deep breath. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you liked it and found it useful. If so, please like, share and comment to let me know what you thought. Your feedback is important to me. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss any of my upcoming videos.